If you are looking for a way to get outside, enjoy yourself, and work out tomorrow, a fitness guru here in Columbia who almost needs no introduction is welcoming you to the State House. James Patrick, good to see you today. So oh, good to be seen, Darcy. Great to see you as well. Peace, love, and sweat. That's what we're doing tomorrow? That's what we're doing tomorrow, and we're talking about mental health while we're working out. All right, so give me the details. Why did you come up with this? We know we've seen you all over town doing different fitness activities, but why was this important for you to do this month? Not only uh, uh, being a mental health advocate, but being a person who uh, was diagnosed with bipolar disorder um, over six years ago, my main focus is to use my platform to help educate and edify uh, and give people purpose on what mental health means for them specifically and the community around them. Peace, Love, Sweat integrates uh, wellness, fitness, and mental health education uh, all in one within an hour time frame. And I thought that it would be most befitting because it is Minority Mental Health Month, but mental health matters all around the year, all throughout the year. So it's not just important in July, but I thought that it would be great just to home in on, on this month. You know, it's really timely too, James, because there's been a lot of focus on mental health, especially when you consider what's happening in the Olympics and athletes making the decision not to compete because of their mental health. Now, as a fitness expert, as an athlete, as someone who understands the importance of mental health, can you talk to us about how all three of those things matter at the same time? Mental health is so important across the board, as I mentioned earlier, Darcy. I think it, it really takes a brave person to step outside of themselves and their career goals to say, my mental health matters the most. I think looking at Simone Biles, it, it, she really set a great example for young athletes uh, and young entrepreneurs across the globe to put their mental health first. And it also creates a better platform that's more sustainable and allows you to integrate uh, your mental health education allowing other people to understand what you're dealing with and how they can be a better service to themselves and the people around them. So mental health, wellness, fitness, athleticism are all interdigitated and it's so important that people take the time to actually understand that. And I'm so glad it's happening right now. All right, James, let's go over the details one more time about tomorrow. Yes, peace, love, sweat. Tomorrow, State House Steps, 9 a.m. to 11 a.m. Who's going to be there? Me, you, your mama, and them, everybody. And we're going to have a great time. We've got an amazing lineup for you guys. So please be sure to be there. All right, James, we can't be there tomorrow. Where else can we find you? I'm sure there's some viewers right now who are saying, I think I like that guy. I may be looking to him to be my trainer. Listen, come on over. 5301 Forest Drive, James Patrick Fitness and Wellness. Uh, we cater to your fitness and wellness needs, post-rehabilitative therapy. Find us on Facebook, James Patrick Fitness and Wellness, as well as Instagram. James Patrick, your fitness guru. Thanks for joining us today, James.